Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness' sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. It's true to say that as a Christian, I am called to witness to my faith wherever I may be. Easier said than done. Often it's simpler just to go with the flow, to accept what's happening and let the bad things go over my head. Yet, I know that Jesus would not have accepted this. In fact, Jesus was not exactly a peacemaker when he overthrew the money changers' tables in the temple, but he made his point. How do I do the same today? You're absolutely right. Jesus was not exactly a peacemaker, but he responded to a situation in a context in a way that was quite prophetic um, and was quite fitting for the place where he was. And so I think the ordinary Christian is, is challenged wherever they are, um, in whatever place and whatever situation, to remember the prophetic challenge of the gospel. Uh, and that's a very exciting uh, and vibrant and a vulnerable place to be as well. But I think more people would say they feel persecuted these days and perhaps that's because it's more known about rather than anything changing perhaps it's just more publicized through the media or through discussions rather than actually anything being any different from 20 30 years ago people are more aware of what they are allowed to do or to say the gospel message has both a corporate and an individual um, heart to it, uh, an, a corporate heart and that we as part of the body of Christ are asked to to listen carefully to our sisters and brothers in parts of the world where they are experiencing persecution, um, but individual in the sense that we need to understand what that challenge means um, for us. Lord Jesus, you who are saviour of our human activity because you bring us a motive for acting and the saviour of our human pain because you endow it with a life-giving value. Be also the saviour of our human unity by compelling us to give up all our pettiness and relying on you to venture forth onto the uncharted ocean of charity. Mm -hmm.